Hi students, our science class is going on. And previous day we learned about our living and non-living thing. Previous day we start with living thing. Those things have life, they are called living thing. But today we learn about non-living things. Those things have no life, they are called non-living things. Okay, now we should go and learn about non-living things. So, our prep science class, living and non-living thing chapter is going on. First of all, things, previous day already I told you, things are two types, living things and non-living things. Tell with me, living things are two types, living things and non-living things. Okay, say orally this is the path. This part is oral. You will say with me. Living things, non-living things. Now, today we learn about non-living things. Say with me loudly. Non-living things. Whom we should call non-living things? Non-living things are the things, those are not alive. That means, those who have no life, they are called non-living things. Okay? Non-living things are the things, those are not alive. That means, it has no life. Next, we will see some examples regarding non-living things. First of all, what is this? This is a beautiful doll. Okay, this is, but this is non-living thing. It has no life. It has life? No, it has no life. Your book. It has life? No, it is a basketball. Or what about the ball? It has no life. This table. It has life? No, it has no life. Why we... Still, it has no life because non-living things do not need non-living things. Do not need. They don't need food. You are taking food every day? Four times. But non-living things, they don't need any food because they have no life. No water. You are drinking water every day, but they don't need any water for their life. Don't need any air because they don't breathe. We take it, but they don't take the air because we the living things are taking air. But they don't take it because they have no life. So, this here today, now I will tell you about non-living things cannot move one place to another place by itself. They cannot move automatically. We can move, we can run, we can jump, we can sleep, many actions we are doing. But all the animals are doing. But non-living things, they have no life, so they cannot move one place to another place. Okay? They, they have no feelings. We are crying, we are sleeping, we have emotion. If our father or mother, they make us happy, we are also feeling happy. If anybody give you chocolate, you are feeling very happy? Yes. Just like another animal also. But other plants also, they are also feeling, have feelings. But the non-living thing, they have no feelings because they have no life. So, you have already learned about this? Okay.